All right, so I want to thank everybody who uh, left a comment on this as far as Weedy Guitar Studios uh, neck, uh, how to fill the dowel rod, dod, da, dowel rod holes. And uh, instead of using the wood, uh, wood shavings or wood dust and glue, um, to use actual wood. So the bad thing about it is I don't have any maple, and I'm not too sure what this is. Uh, want to say maybe it's pine i'm not too sure um but other than this piece here which is square and too small well, all i got is this i thought about using some flame maple veneer but uh that's a little bit on the too thin side so i wanted this to stick up a little bit so i can end up sanding it flush with the body or with the neck so this is what i came up with still a little bit darker but uh yeah it actually came out pretty nice not too bad fits in there perfectly I still have to level sand it a little bit and now I'm going to attempt to get rid of this one and make it look like I think this looks a hell of a lot better than that so maybe if I put some uh, I don't know if I put any stain on it I think it'll end up darking it up even more but I think that's a lot better to look at and I'm going to fix this here too even though I filled it I don't like it I want to do this with it and put some wood inside there actual wood and uh, yeah so thanks everybody and uh, thanks zip and anybody else who mentioned to use an actual piece of wood this worked out really really good I just wish I had the right uh, right color of wood and like I said I think this is a pine or something so I've got enough to do the other side and uh, yeah I think that's a lot better to look at than just a dark orange dot. Alright, take it easy.